That's insane. That's actually that's so cool. He's wild out. Out. This guy's one. Start on Yoshi's here. Uh, I'm, I'm... Well... I'm sure these two both know a lot more than me. I'm gonna start here. Um, yeah, I've seen... I think this is the third spacey set that I've seen start on um, Yoshi's, which is interesting. I feel like this would be where Fox wants to be. Ah, uh, maybe. A lot less uh, room for Mario to shoot his Yeah, own. yeah, to set up like laser pressure, set up laser control. I agree with that. Um, you see, at the top level, you see him strike to a uh, Dreamland a lot, which is also interesting. I don't know. I don't know a ton about who likes which stages in this matchup. Yeah, these two both know a lot more than us, probably. About it. But, uh, it's your boys on the mic, so. <coughs> We'll feed you all the misinformation you need. I'm trying to actively make you worse. Um. Oh. Sick shine. Maybe hit these full hop dares. I really like. Just a good opening. That was just a great stop by there. Yeah. Zero to death. Yeah, that's super smart. Had the lead, uh, flub to the game. Hmm. SD for Mary, but still in the lead. The kitchen table mostly avoiding laser pressure so far by just going to the platforms. Smart by today to use the platforms. Mario's it's definitely to just dash around. Yeah. It's definitely one way to answer that. I feel like it's indicative that he can't really deal with them when he's on the ground. Like showing that he's not really confident in his power shields and also that like he doesn't have like a strong game plan in terms of like take laser options. Crazy, crazy guys. Right? And the Mark thing is, he's gonna have to go down to the ground at some point. Yeah, yeah. And table takes him to FD. This could be interesting. I want to see how table deals with these lasers now. He doesn't have the platforms to avoid. Mm. Gets a grab. Gets some good percent. Mari, big chun. Getting shot. Shines him. Gets the ledge. Ooh. Mario with a bit of a response. Ooh, yeah. Something I love that uh, Mari does very well is he'll get his openings, he'll get his punishes that he can get, and then right. he'll just back off. Yeah, and he'll disengage. Yeah, he, he, he really he rarely overextends. Yeah, he's I agree. Really good. And I'd like to say that that first stock was taken by um, Table just running towards ledge and ripping that same up smash, and Mari literally just like shine daring him for it. So I like to see Mario like catching on to that pattern. I'd really like to see Table adapt to that and take some different options to pressure and like in the corner. So that's a rip. Ooh. Ooh table. Oh. Table's pretty good at these. Uh, yeah. He's he's definitely getting the conversions, which is solid. Getting a lot of damage off those hits. And he's got muscle stage. Ooh, yeah. And he gets punished again for just letting that up smash work. It, it really feels like a bad habit that's losing him a lot so far this game. Mari's really good at uh, catching on to a habit. And yeah, yeah. Calling it out every time. So. Yeah, that experience and just general game awareness is like something that definitely separates like tiers of players for sure. And like, Mario's got a ton of that, I think, in terms of like adaptation and just generally picking out like bad items. Yeah, he's dared. Yeah, he's super dead. Really good angle, but yeah, not a whole lot you can do with those Fox. Nice, he read the roll in. Gets him off stage. I don't know what Fox does there. I don't know if he can cover many of those options. Um, yeah, he's not gonna die there. Good DI from Mari. <laughs> I'd, I'd like to see 
Let me set up laser control a little more and neutral. Just like kind of laser in place and just see how um, the table deals with it. Yeah, he did a bit there. Yeah. I like Mario just lasering in center. Small lead here for uh, really smart crouch cancel there. Convert it. Nice tech. The table gets it again. Oh, insane tech right there. Absolute mad lad. Oh, he's got him off stage. He gets spiked there. That's a uh, fun. Take some straight back. Yeah, that was, was that was really good defense. I don't know what tables can even do if he doesn't tech those. But yeah, I think if you're a fox and you're below the ledge uh, against the falco, you stop him. Yeah, yeah, that up tilt was insane by Jamie. Let's see if we can keep him in the corner. Here. Um, okay, yeah, that F smash works. Didn't couldn't quite get there because he traded without me. Nice. Ooh, up tilt. Oh, the laser reset just barely missed the timing on the F smash. That would have been nasty. Mario's controlling his space really, really well. Right really smart shorting from Mario too to avoid that up smash again. So it's the third time tables up the uh, up smash in the corner rip, and it is worked that time. Oh, one the late there. I like, yeah, I like the idea from Mario. Smart boy, smart boy. Ooh, yeah, runs into up tilt. I really like those up tilts from the table there. So that's gonna just be a lot of things. <laughs> Especially like up tilt in play specifically. When you have them in the corner. Mario with a bit of lead. Oh. Nice angle. Good uh, ledge by Mario. Ooh. Table just barely misses that up smash conversion. Oh. Bit of an Still opening right. here. He's off the doing Falco stuff. Yeah, get, he snaps the ledge again. What can, uh, what do you think Fox can do uh, against a double laser from ledge by Falco? Um. That's a good question. Depending on his spacing, maybe just take them and like, if he's like relatively close to the ledge, just like take them and like air out of it or something. I'm not sure. Insane F smash. Yeah. Mario played pretty well. Mario played pretty well. And now, we're going to see a big old uh, Suffer near match. The Suffer grudge.